Hi, and welcome to the presentation of our paper, a study on the relative importance of convolutional neural networks in visual aware recommended systems. My name is Daniela Maritesto, and I'm a PhD student at Politecnico di Bari. Recommended systems are the pivotal components of popular online platforms like Zalando, Amazon, and Netflix, since they provide users with lists of most relevant products to buy so easy the decision-making process of choosing from larger and heterogeneous catalogs offered by such platforms. Then, when items from e-commerce platforms are shown with photographs, we could think of enriching the user item interaction matrix with high-level visual features extracted from product images. And this could be performed, for example, by means of pre-trained convolutional neural networks. This kind of recommended system are better known as visually aware recommended systems, like the one displayed in this slide. However, the literature shows that there exists a lack of homogeneity in the selection of pre-trained convolutional neural networks and the top of visually aware recommended systems. In particular, we have found that there exist three main families for extracting visual features and they are AlexNet, ResNet, and VGG, with AlexNet and ResNet being the most adopted models because AlexNet is the first example of convolutional neural network for image classification, while ResNet is uh, among the most recent approaches. Thus, our main contributions can be summarized as follows. We test the changing in the recommendation performance on a suite of visual aware recommended systems and pre-trained convolutional neural networks from the state of the art. And then we propose a novel quantitative and qualitative metric for assessing the visual diversity of already uh, interactive items and recommended ones. For the experimental setting, we adopted state of the art visual aware recommended systems, which are VBPR, DeepStyle, ACF and VNPR. For the pre-trained CNNs, we, uh, we adopted, as already mentioned, AlexNet, VGG19, and ResN50. And we decided to, to test the models on a very popular dataset from the Amazon catalog. From a recommendation perspective, we analyzed the accuracy of recommendation, but also the novelty and the diversity in the provided list of recommendation. We think that these latter two measures could be important for users to be always engaged with novel and diversified recommended items, and for companies to better understand which set of items to insert into the huge catalogs. From the table, we can notice that Resident 50 is generally the best performing image feature extractor, thus demonstrating the importance of deeper model in extracting meaningful visual features. On the other hand, we can also see that ACF is the only exception to the rule, with AlexNet being the best performing image feature extractor. This could be due to the fact that while VBPR, DeepStyle and VMPR use higher level visual features extracted from fully connected layers, ACF uses lower level visual features extracted from convolutional layer. So the depth of the model is not important anymore. Finally, we propose a novel metric called visual diversity to assess how visually different are historical items and recommend ones for each user from a quantitative and a qualitative perspective. For the former, we calculated the Euclidean distance between the centroids of the historical and recommended items. So higher values stand for more visually diverse outcomes. And from the table, we can notice that, once again, um, Resonant 50 is the best performing image feature extractor. For the latter, we projected the visual embeddings of historical and um, recommended items into the latent space by using green borders and red borders for historical and recommended items, respectively. From a visual inspection, we can notice that AlexNet is uh, um, recommending uh, the same category as the uh, historical items, so trekking shoes, 
why ResNet is not only um, recommending novel categories, so socks and boots, but they are also diverse from a color point of view. Thank you very much for your attention.